but I never left to you. I did leave, however, because I was doing my assignment. Um, so I had two assignments back to back, one due on the 27th, one due on the 31st. Today is the 30th, and I finished like really early this morning, like 2 a.m. Um, I actually finished like 1, I think, 1.30, and then 30 minutes I spent doing my hair. Um, but yeah, finished this morning. And so I can finally breathe, like legitimately breathe. Um, I think tomorrow's the 31st, but I need to, I want to post it today because I don't like, um, submitting on the day of submission. So, that's what's happening. Today's Monday, like I said. I have to cook today, but, um, we had a hair appointment at 9. It is currently 9.26, and the hairdresser that we go to told us that they, um, have load shedding at the moment, so we should just kind of wait until they know what's happening. We know that we don't have load shedding at the moment, so there must be a problem, um, maybe like a cable fault or something like that. And so, um, she told us to wait until, um, she knows that it's going to come back, or if it comes back, then she'll let us know. But, um, so that was supposed to be at 9 o'clock. We were supposed to be there and getting our hair done. Um, because later on we have to go for a fitting for dresses that we got made for a wedding that we are going to or like a wedding type of ceremony that we're going to this weekend um, it's gonna be out of town so we're gonna drive there on Friday um, and then drive back on Saturday after the actual ceremony because on Sunday my sister has we have to take my sister to her um, nursing school uh, she has to go look at her res and then she starts on Monday, so hectic week and weekend. We also have to find a gift for the person that we are going to a wedding for. Um, so that's also on the agenda. But the first thing we were supposed to do is get our hair done. Now that's been pushed back. And so I know we're just going to get back later, which is kind of stressing me out. We also have to go get our lashes removed. And I also have to go pick up my glasses. So I went to the eye doctor last week and I think I kind of vlogged that day, kind of, sort of. Um, and so we went there. And I think it was, I think I went on Monday. The glasses were ready on Wednesday, but I told them I'd come back and get them on Monday because it was my assignment. So... I'm gonna go and do that today, hopefully, and yeah, I think that's all on the agenda for this week, but I'm so glad I'm done with my assignment. I actually just want to submit it and be done with it, like for real, for real, um, but I took my call to service. I'm finally gonna read this book, mainly because I think it's the earliest purchase of all those books, uh, that or um, The Spanish Self-Deception. I don't know. Well, every other book that I have that I purchased before this one, I've read. So this is the next one. I'm going to read this. Hopefully, I like it. It doesn't seem too bad. 300 pages. Yeah, 380. Almost 100 pages in this book. So I'm going to pick this up. And give it a gander. That's the update on that. I'll update you when we leave. Maybe. Or not. I don't know. Hi, everyone. Um... So let me explain, right? Um, today's Tuesday. Uh, it is the... Today's Tuesday. I think I started a vlog. I want to say yesterday. Yes, okay. I started a vlog yesterday. I had every intention of vlogging like throughout the day. And today, because t this is a busy week, we're a tactic. So, um, or maybe I started the vlog on Friday, I can't remember. But on that day that I started the vlog, during the day I got some news. Um, not bad news, but not necessarily good news. So, um, it just kind of put a kink in our plans for this weekend. And so we're trying to iron it out. And, but... Like the whole thing just got me so stressed out that I did not pick up the camera. I haven't picked up the camera. This is the first time I'm talking to you since that last clip. And I had the camera with me that whole day. 
but I left it in the car. I didn't want to do anything. I was just so stressed out trying to find a solution. Still don't have one. We're still kind of in limbo, but we're kind of like dealing with it a little bit better over here. So anyway, I wanted to give you an update. I went to go do my hair, obviously. I think I vlogged. I was supposed to vlog the day that I did my hair. Okay, so got my hair done. I did a middle part because um, I always do the side part. I always do the side part and I like it, but I want to switch it up. And I like middle parts on me. I think. I like them on me, like with my own hair. This, you see this part is curled? I didn't do that, but I like that. So I might do that. Um, anyway, got my hair done. Got my lashes taken off. And I got new glasses. How cute are these? I absolutely love them. I love them so much. But um, if you look closely, like the one side is kind of sitting on my nose. Not the other side isn't. I don't know. Um, I just got them today. So um, I'll go back tomorrow. We're very busy. So uh, sorry this is all jumbled up. But did my, did my hair. Then we went to the, the place I was doing our dresses for this weekend. Got there. The guy wasn't done with them. And so he told us to come back today, Tuesday. We went back today, he was done with mine and my mom's pieces, and then my sister's piece he's not done with. And so he told us to come back tomorrow, and we're like, oh my gosh, we can't keep coming back here. It's like quite far, it's like in the south. Um, but he's really good, so we'll drive, I don't mind. So, so let's come back tomorrow, we said, oh, we're kind of busy, so we'll go back on Thursday. I got a couple of stuff from there, so that's the, he's at the same um, Chinatown that I get my uh, ramen from and I got some gochujang yesterday when we went and I'm so excited it's the only supermarket Chinese shop that actually that I've seen have it so I picked it up um, it's just like hot red chili paste or hot red paste hot pepper paste there we go that's what it is it's hot pepper paste it's called gochujang it's like an Asian Korean Asian Korean I'm sorry if I'm messing it up but um, it's a it's an ingredient that's in a lot of like Asian inspired meals, and I love Asian food. So um, I got some of that, and then today we went to go get my sister's hair done because yesterday she was, she was undecided about what she wanted to do. So we went to go do her hair today. We went to the place to go get my piece, my dress, and my mom's two piece, um, and then my sister's one we'll get on Thursday, and. Then we came to the mall, got my new glasses, love them. They're so much bigger than the ones that I had. Um, so I feel like you'll see my makeup a lot more. So I need to be on my game, but also like I don't care. Anyway, we went to the mall. I picked up this soap styler by Makeup Revolution. Ooh. Um, I've been watching a lot of Monet. I love Monet. I've said this a million times, but I absolutely adore Monet. She's everything. And she likes that laminated brow look. And she did say that it's not for everyone. But look at this compact. This is fancy. So nice. Makeup Revolution. It comes with... Hold on. Let me open her up real quick. Give me a minute. Come on. Everybody's watching. There we go. Huh. So look at this. Um, it comes with a mirror. So fancy, right? Like, anyway, never mind. It's this, uh, like, just like clear gel, uh, and it comes with a teeny tiny little brush. How cute! Anyway, it's so cute. This rose gold Hi. packaging. It does feel heavy because of the mirror, but. It, it will get fingerprints on it. Anyway, that's not the point. I bought it because Monet loves a laminated brow. And I've never done one before. So I thought I'd try it out. And that's why I picked it up. She did say it's not for everyone. But I want to try it out, you know. Give it a fair shot. Maybe I'll love it. But anyway, we did that. What else did we do? We went to Peek and Pay. I got the scarf. How pretty. I'll show you my dress. <sighs> We're leaving on Friday, coming back on Saturday because Sunday my sister has school. I, I think I mentioned that. 
Um, so, and I'm, I think I'm driving. I'm, I'm almost like 90% sure I'm driving. So, um, I'll try and vlog. I'll try and show the outfit on Saturday. I'll try, I'll take my camera with and try and vlog. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. Um, it's not really our function, we're invited, so I don't want to re be in everyone's face with the camera, but uh, I'll see. Um, so I got this scarf because I'm going to wear my dress with, uh, like, beige boots that I have from Woods, the ones with the fur. Because I don't have green shoes and I'm definitely not wearing open toe shoes. It is freezing outside, oh my gosh. So anyway, Pink and Pink has these beautiful scarves. They have all of them in, like, this pastel color. Um, they have a blue, they have a green, they have this one, they have a darker brown, like, they're so pretty. I want every single one, and they're 95 bucks, so I picked that up, and they're so soft, so soft. Here's the price. I feel like I'm missing something. Oh, I did get ramen. I got the creamy carbonara, because they didn't have the regular carbonara. Um, what else? I think that's all we did between today and yesterday. We... I have been looking for a green undertop for my sister to wear because she's doing a suit. Um, if I have one, I'll put an inspo pic right here. But otherwise, you will see it. I'll try and get a video of her as well. But she's doing a suit and um, so she needs like an undertop. And because it's so cold, preferably a turtleneck e type top. It's actually, it's 20 to 9. We literally just walked into the house at 8 o'clock. We poured petrol, spent a thousand bucks filling up the tank. And I'm driving my, technically it's my car, but I'm, I normally drive the other car. And the other car takes up way more, so I'm glad we don't have it. But I still filled it up for a thousand bucks, which is crazy. But petrol's going up tomorrow, so I have to. But yeah, I think that's everything that I wanted to tell you. I got Disney Plus. Oh. We got Disney Plus. I actually want to try this. Hold on. I want to try this right now. That's the whole reason why I started this. I was saying we got Disney Plus the other day. I've been watching the Kardashians because, you know, this is a no judgment zone. Um, I love it so far. But they have so many. Mo they have Princess Diaries, which I don't know if I've told you, but it's like one of my favorite movies ever. I don't know if you can see it, but I like it. I'm not even, um, it's, I don't fill my brows that much. So this one's not filled, but the brows are brushed up and this one's filled. Obviously I have brow hairs. I'm grateful that they're easy to manage, so I don't need to fill them in that much. But yeah, I've just filled this one in a little bit. This one's not filled, that one's filled. I kind of like it, not gonna lie. Okay. So this is me. I just did a, a whole face. Um, not a whole face, but like I put foundation on. Because I wanted to test out this microfiber brush. This is how I normally fill my brows. But they, they were never so like fluffy. And then I did some foundation with this uh, fiber brush. I think it's called a microfiber brush. I've had it for a while, but it's so big I don't use it. But I think maybe if I'm looking for like a... Like that no makeup makeup type situation... I think if that's what I'm going for, then it works wonders because I have foundation on right now. It's very subtle. I, I can't, I can barely see it. Uh, I'm sure you can see a difference from before and now. I'm going to wipe it off now because I'm done playing. It's late actually. Why do you get the urge to do your makeup randomly at night? On a work night or something. Like, why doesn't the urge come to you on a Saturday when <laughs> you're watching TV? Oh, one last thing before I say bye. I bought this at Chandor because, you know, it's pretty, like, for your dress if you're doing, like, a mesh top and you want, um, you know, something to cover your tatas. Um, that's nice. I also bought something else. Uh, I can't find the new one. Hold on. I bought this little thing from Chamdo as well, which I was so excited to see 
because it's it's just like a, a cutter but i'll show you now for like packages and things like that um so this is what it looks like it's just a, a little package cutter and you slide this thing up and this is, the knife comes out of there there we go you slide it up and it doesn't stay out which i love but if you want it to stay out you just push a little bit harder and then it kind of locks in place and then you pull it back down but i love it i love it so much i got three of them they're 10 bucks each which is so cool but yeah one is downstairs when we have packages delivered and we're downstairs we can open it and then i have one upstairs in my cupboard and then i have another one i wanted to keep this one in my bag but then my mom like scared me so i don't want to anymore but yeah it's pretty late i'm gonna go have dinner i'll see you guys tomorrow ah uh, will i i'll try i'll see you tomorrow relax i will maybe okay morning everyone um so these are my old glasses so yeah just thought i'd mention that i don't know why i think because you saw me in new glasses yesterday <sighs> let me show you i can see really well with both of them so i will be using both of them <laughs> these are the new ones so we're going to the mall today we're gonna go look for a gift for the bride because it's her birthday on her like wedding day and then we are looking for some undertops. I need to go get shoes that I saw at H&M. I left them because they were slightly like damaged. Not damaged, but like they they looked poorly constructed. So I left them to go and check at a different H&M. But I was supposed to do that today, but I can't really wait. I'm kind of impatient. So I'm going to get them and then we'll deal with it after. Um, but I wanted to say good morning because it is, it's half past 11 and we're going to leave. I'm going to try my best to bring it along. I am definitely, definitely going to try. Hopefully the shoes are still at H&M because if they're not, I'm going to be super pissed. Like pissed enough to go far and get them. And the petrol just went up today, so that's probably not a good idea, but... Oh, okay, let me tell you about this. So, I got a take-a-lot delivery this morning. Oh. Um, that my mom was using. So, my mom was taking these pills. She's been taking them for the past, like, two months or something. Um, and last month, she gave me, like, a few to take. And after taking them, I kid you not, my skin was literally glowing to the nines, okay? Like, it was so, like, my skin looks so good. So, um, did some research and apparently people do take them, like, together to achieve glowing skin. Um, I also know that, um, one of them is really, is an antioxidant and it's also, like, an immune support thing in my bob. But anyway, so before... After I started, I took those few that my mom gave me, I was on my Instagram and one of the girls that I follow, she was taking them as well. And she takes them like part of her everyday routine. I'm like, oh my gosh, that's crazy. So I just, it kind of like made me feel like, okay, may, I want to take them because my skin looks so good. All glutathione and um, vitamin C. Okay, so I'm gonna go get the shoes. Oh, let me show you the crown. What? Did I show it to you like this? Okay. So I got this crown, like, uh, when my sister was going to her matric dance. And I loved it. I loved the leaves and the flowers. And just, it was just so, like, fairy-like for me. And so I plan on wearing this on my birthday. Oh my gosh. I mean, this is not the prettiest thing you've ever seen. Oh my goodness. I feel like I should be on Bridgerton or something, you know, because naturally. I'm going to go. I'll, I'll see you guys at the mall. Okay? I'll see you guys in H&M. I think that's going to be our first stop because I'm kind of like going crazy, but yeah. So yeah, let's go. <laughs> Say hi! Say hi! Say hi! Say 
hai suy hai hai how are you how are you uh -huh. I miss you baby I miss you I love you I love you Yeah, I'll be joining you guys very, very soon. She's lying. <laughs> <laughs> soon we got something cooking. We just need to talk about stuff. But yeah, I'm at work. Hello. So, it's Trinko Pies. Trinko Pies? Huh? Say, Baba. I'm going to open it. I'm going to listen to Baba and be good. Good job. <laughs> enough footage like when I was vlogging but on our way to the mall like my sister called me and asked us to pick up the babe so we went there it wasn't part of the plan it is 5 30 we were not supposed to come back this late we were literally supposed to be going to the mall coming back so she called us also to get uh, my nephew because he was with her and he she needed to work so we went to go get him then we popped into Woolworths. I went to H&M to get the boots. I think I showed you, but I'll show you again now. Um, I'll also include them in the actual like winter clothes haul once I eventually do it, if I eventually do it. Um, but let me show you. So these are the boots. They're just a beautiful, sleek, black boot. Super shiny, combat style, but not like the thick platform like um, the other ones that I have. Not like the Doc Martens style thick platform, but Doc Martens also has like really thin ones, but they're not as thin. So they're kind of like a beautiful middle ground. How nice. I absolutely love them. They look so good on like with a, a pair of um, joggers or sweatpants and a matching top or just like any top, just like sweatpants. It looks so good. Um, I can see these with um, pantyhose and like a long line sweater, not sweater, like a, a knit jersey, like almost like a dress, but not really. Love that. That's my vibe this winter, I feel like. So long line uh, knit jerseys with pantyhose or leggings and booties. So I'm super excited I got these. These were 4 29 uh, there we go. Those are selling like hotcakes because the, there was only two left. There was two left yesterday, but luckily they were still there today. And then we went to Woolworths and I picked up these. How cute. So I initially wanted, they have a pair that's like folded over, like folded out like this. I wanted those, but my foot doesn't, it doesn't go into that at all. Like nothing. So these were three forty nine, but they're on promotion. You get forty percent off. They have forty percent off like their knits and winter stuff right now. So not everything, obviously, but so yeah, pick these up. Super cute. They're this is like my favorite color of those winter shoes things. It went to pick me clothing, and I picked up a pair of uh, ankle socks, low cut socks. Um, these are size 8 to 10, which is so amazing because I usually get size like I think it's like 4 to 6 or 4 to 7. I don't know, but it's they're tiny. So 8 to 10, these better be like super comfortable. And these were 70 bucks. And then I picked up two v neck shirts from Pick and Pay as well. It was two 400 bucks, and I got two black ones, like the exact same shirt twice in the exact same color because I'm I'm that person yeah I know gosh yeah I'm so happy about these shoes from H&M 
I tried them on yesterday and then I left them in the store because they had like a little scuff mark on them but I've been thinking about them since yesterday so I just decided to get them um it's not really a scuff mark it's just like poorly constructed like you can see some of the glue in the front but it's barely there like I would have to show you for you to be able to see what I'm talking about but um you won't see not unless you're an ant or something um so yeah that's everything that I got I spent way too much money today I'm not spending money on anything else nothing so yeah today's Wednesday tomorrow we're going to go check um my sister not check collect because time's run out I'm gonna go collect my sister's suit and I'm also taking I have two dresses here that I'm taking to the tailor guy who's making who made our clothes um i want him to open up some of my dresses and by open up i mean like make them bigger because they don't fit me like as um comfortably as they used to so he definitely needs to open them up um so that i can be comfortable and i can breathe so i want to show you what they look like on but my sister's downstairs so there's no one to zip me up but i'll show you how they look so this is the first dress. Um, I wore this to my sister's wedding. This was my sister's wedding dress for me. So this is, I'll find a picture of me in this dress, which I, I do have because I've seen it recently. Um, but yeah, this is the dress. So this one, I just need a little more room in the Tata area because it's tight. This one, I don't think I have a picture in it, but I'll, I'll try to look for one. So... So it's a mermaid type dress, is that what they're calling it still? So yeah, it's this mermaid style dress. I'll try and look for a picture, but I don't think I have one. Not on this phone anyway. But yeah, I'll try and look for a picture and like put it in. So we went to Four Ways basically and we got these from Four Ways, but they do have them. Like I saw them close by the other day so I'm gonna edit this video try and finish editing it it's it's six o'clock uh seven eight nine it takes me about three hours to edit I'm hopefully gonna be finished by nine so I can actually go watch tv because oh my gosh I haven't been able to watch tv for so long because I was busy with my assignments and now I'm finally done and now we're like crunch 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 because everything's happening so we're trying to get ready for this weekend let me edit this video.